Hello YouTubers and welcome to the Deals Prime Review Channel. Today we're doing a live Antutu X benchmark test for the people M7T and uh, this is a 3G WCDMA phone calling tablet PC. This has an 8.9 inch IPS screen and uh, it's powered by a 1.6 gigahertz CPU quad core rock chip uh, 3188 is a chipset this also has built-in uh, Bluetooth, built-in GPS, 5 megapixel camera on the back, 2 megapixel camera on the front, 2 gigabyte DDR3 RAM, 16 gigabyte ROM, and uh, the screen resolution on the uh, 8.9 inch IPS screen should be 1920 by 1200. So while this is running, make sure to like our video. Also, subscribe to the Deals Prime Review channel our YouTube channel and uh, there's a link to this uh, People M7T inside of our YouTube video description now how does the M7T differ than the People M7? well number one the M7 is now out of production um, and the M7T uh, adds built-in 3G and uh, built-in uh, phone calling uh, again 3G and quad band GSM phone calling so that's the main difference And uh, we'll just wait for Antutu to confirm uh, the specs that we have on our side are correct. Again, uh, like our video. Also, subscribe to the Deals Prime Review channel. After this, we'll show you the build of the tablet. Also, accessories, the free YouTube promo gift, and then we'll go in depth. So, this will be an all in one review. And here it is M17, 19,297. It's a nice, respectable score there. Check out the details, and uh, while doing this, I'll scroll in on a little bit so everyone can see this very clearly. Okay, so it's running Android 4.2.2 operating system. 1.6 quad uh, gigahertz quad quad core CPU, 2 gigabyte DDR3 RAM, and it has a Mali 400 GPU. We'll check out device info here. There we go. Zoom out a little bit. Okay, so this is the M7T. It's running Android 4.2.2, 1920 by 1200 pixel resolution screen, 5 megapixel camera on the back. This does have root access. 16 gigabyte DDR3 RAM with about 12.3 or 12.7 gigabytes free. And a 9.3 inch screen. Again, sometimes Antutu is a little bit off on the reading, so this is an 8.9 inch screen. 240 DPI, 2 megapixel camera on the front. And this firmware was last updated on January 7th, so totally a brand new uh, release. It supports these. Uh, the sensor so you can uh, pause the screen wherever you want okay so again it gets a score of 19,297 now let's uh, just show you off the uh, actually go to the, the little menu this actually has a nice little UI, U, um, user interface UI which you just now saw there just want to check with uh, Deals Prime uh, just to make sure that those specs are correct. So uh, here it is. And we'll just click onto that. Again, there's a link to this product inside of our YouTube video description. So 2 GB DDR3 RAM, 16 GB ROM. 2 megapixel camera on the front, 5 megapixel on the back, has built in GPS and Bluetooth. Here are some of the accessories you can bundle with this unit. And it has Bluetooth 4.0, eCompass, 16 to 10 ratio screen, 1920 by 1200 pixel resolution screen. 
so it does support uh, phone calling so uh, looks like it is as uh, Antutu says it is and uh, we'll just show you the build of the tablet now we'll zoom out a little bit so the power button is here and that's actually also the uh, sleep button so we'll zoom out now and here is a sim uh, here's a sim card slot here full size sim card slot micro SD card slot 3.5 millimeter headphone jack micro USB port dual micro USBs so this is a host and this is a USB so you can use this to plug in uh, a pin drive or anything like that that has USB and while we're here actually here's a 5 megapixel camera here on the back and the flash and here's a pinhole reset button so if your tablet uh, stops on you or if it freezes for any reason you can uh, gently press this with a pin and uh, reset that mini HDMI port mic hole DC 5 volt in power slash uh, sleep and escape menu button here is a speaker here, a speaker here, so dual speakers, so definitely going to be a loud tablet. This uh, on the side it's plastic and on the middle, in the middle it's like a brushed aluminum metal. And uh, no buttons there, you can see that it's really thin though. Really thin tablet. And uh, we'll, and here's a 2 megapixel camera here on the front. So we actually actually check out what it comes with. Let's check out that new uh, uh, interface there. I really like it. So inside the box comes now this. Uh, Part in here will probably not be included, like the inside, because we're going to put bubble wrap so your screen will be protected during shipping. Extra protection. Comes with a wall charger. This is a US style plug. And this is a 100 to 240 volt uh, rated. And it's a 5 volt, 2.5 amp charger. And uh, if you're in the UK, Europe, or Australia, it will come with your country's power plug adapter free, only from Dios Prime. It also has uh, some wireless uh, hands-free earbuds or earphones, so you can listen to music here, people branded, and uh, here's a nice silicone, uh, nice and soft silicone for your ears. Turn the screen off, it's a little bit bright. Let's put it up to the side here. So here you can see the hands-free button here, you can uh, answer calls and stuff using that clip for the clip and clip it onto your shirt it also comes with a USB uh, host cable so you can plug in a keyboard case pin drive or anything like that OTG cable this is an OTG cable and a USB data cable so you can connect this to your computer to transfer files and it looks like a pinhole. No, this is a one of those like tray pins. So you use this to, I guess, pull it. This may be a pinhole reset button. Okay. Well, you can use this to uh, to press the reset button here gently. But generally, this is used for the SIM card slot tray, which it doesn't look like it has. So it looks like you can just pop in the SIM there. But you can actually use this to because uh, sometimes when you push this press the sim in which I don't have right now uh, you need to use this to push it in just a little bit more so that's exactly what this is for it's not a pinhole it's not for the pinhole reset it's to press this in the sim into the tray further and to also uh, take it out but when you put this in make sure to put it in uh, parallel and don't like slant it in or else it won't work so just uh, put it parallel in with the slot okay and there's a free YouTube promo gift when you order from Dios Prime we will include a free neoprene case and uh, it will be big enough to uh, fit your uh, M7T inside nice ten dollar value in order to get this and the order no section during checkout make sure to ask us to please include the free YouTube promo case 
for the free YouTube pro, uh, neoprene case, and we will. In order to see the order notes section though, during checkout, you actually need to register on dealsprime.com. And then, once you've uh, registered, you can log in, check out, and during checkout, you'll see the order notes section. Okay, let's go a little bit in depth now. And I just want to remind you to like our video. Also, subscribe to the Dealers Prime Review channel. There's a link to this product inside of our uh, YouTube video description. Okay, so here we have a nice uh, new user interface from people. I've never seen this before, so it's, it's totally new. So this uh, we have it 6:43. Nice little time thing there, and it says shows the time zone, the date. So you can turn uh, Wi-Fi on or off. It's uh, on right now, but you can turn it off there. So quick access, quick access control. And flight mode is off, Bluetooth is off, but you can turn it on there and you can see the icon turn up there on in the upper right hand corner. And this looks like it's uh, maybe it's like the GPS thing. Okay, pictures, uh, messaging. So this does have uh, phone calling and messaging capabilities. So this standard Android 4.2 UI there for that. Internet, telephone, so again there's no SIM but you can hear that it does have a hands-free speaker on that. And uh, we'll just check out the menu, so here are the icons. So a to x benchmark which we downloaded and we just now show you the results, browser. This does not come uh, pre-installed, by the way. Camera. So again, there's a cam 5, meg 5 megapixel camera on the back. And uh, we'll just take one picture here just quickly to oh, take a picture of this. Check out the gallery here real quick. And it's kind of hard to take a picture during a review, but you can see here it's nice and clear. Ebook reader, email, gallery, Gmail, GPS. So this has built-in standalone GPS. Google Local, Google, Google Maps, Messaging, Music, Navigation, Notes, Notepad, People, Phone, Play Store, which we uh, downloaded the Antutu benchmark from. And a video player, let's see if there's anything pre installed. So you can see here it has a wide viewing angle, IPS screen is 178 degrees, you can hear the, the little speakers here, it's really loud, even though you guys probably don't understand what he's saying. Okay, get out of that real quick. Okay, we have a 15 minute, uh, we have a 15 minute limit on uh, YouTube, so we'll get to, uh, We'll, go, we'll, we'll do a part two uh, in, in depth with the settings review. Uh, but we'll just do some web browsing real quick. And uh, so we can make this a true all in one video. Well, not really true, but again, it's on Dios Prime. The link is in our video description. And uh, we'll just go to a couple other sites just to show you the quad core in action. So uh, we're just about wrapping up here. Make sure to like our video, subscribe to the Deals Prime Review channel. Go to a couple more sites if we can. The clock is ticking. Okay, so nice and fast. Okay, guys, well, this is just about uh, concludes this review. Make sure to like our video, subscribe to the Deals Prime Review channel, and thanks for watching.